Hi, this is Nuno and today I'm going to show you how to use Connection Open plugin with Ableton Live. Let's get started. So the first thing we need to do is to open Ableton Live. Let's assume we want to record the microphone in a separated track and the session on another track. Um, we need to first just for guide ourselves through the process let's name this track as microphone this track as connection open and uh, an another track which will be the session audio Okay, so now we need to place here a connection open plugin. One important note is you need to have the buffer size at 128 samples. On Ableton Live, you just need to open settings, edit, uh, preferences, option preferences, sorry and choose under your hardware setup the buffer size as 128. This will ensure maximum performance of the connection open audio engine so there are no audio dropouts. Okay so then we need to receive on the connection open track the audio from the microphone track so in order to do that, we need to set um, this track with audio from microphone. And on the session audio, we need to, track, uh, to set audio from connection open track. And since we want to record the microphone track, we need to arm this track. And we need to set the monitor to auto so that the audio flows to the next track. And since we want to, we will not arm this track, but we want to get the audio into the plugin, so we will set the monitor in here. Uh, you will see why, because if when we open this plugin, if we don't set the monitor to in, it will not show audio input inside the plugin. So Let's keep this enabled and we also need to set the session audio to record so let's arm this track for record. To do that, to do this we need to control, sh control click on this icon uh, otherwise it will set exclusively the track so we need to control click and we'll, both tracks will be enabled for recording. So now, now let's shift to, to the arrangement view by pressing tab and OK. So now we just need to call someone. Let's set Ableton to record, open connection, open plugin and let's call Randy. Hey Randy. Hey Nuno. We are connecting with you today to show people how to use Connection Open with the VST plugin inside of Ableton. Cool. Can you give me some levels? Absolutely. Opening Connection Open inside of your DAW is just one of the many cool things that Connection Open offers to make sure that you always have a really good session and an excellent ride. Yeah, that's right. I will check with you later, okay Randy? We'll be right here. See you next time. As you can see, it's very easy to use Connection Open with Ableton Live. Let us know if you have any questions. We will be here to help you. Thank you for watching and see you on the next tutorial.